Hi friends, uh, welcome back to my channel. Uh, in this video, we are going to discuss about a normal probability plot. So it is a visual technique or the graphical uh, technique that is used to visually check whether the data has come from a normal distribution or not. So it is basically to check whether the data is normally distributed or not. And uh, this we are going to uh, check by plotting the data uh, in Jupyter Notebook of Python. So let's start with the uh, code. And uh, if you have not subscribed to this channel, please consider subscribing. To get the latest update, click on the bell icon. So let's start with the code. So for this, uh, we need to import a few libraries. So let's import uh, pandas and uh, matplot lib for the graph plotting dot pyplot as plt and we also require uh, scipy scipy dot stats import probability plot So now we have uh, imported all the libraries. So let's load the data. So we have the data in a CSV file. So data is equal to pd dot read CSV. And our data is in F drive. And the file name is user.csv. Let's run this and uh, check. Yes, we have loaded the data. So now here we can see uh, we have uh, three heads, north, south and central. So these are the data points for uh, payment, payment timings, uh, randomly selected, 24 data points are there. So which is randomly selected from uh, different regions and it is uh, arranged in the ascending order. So we have three uh, columns here, north, south and central. And uh, let's see whether uh, this is normally distributed or not. For that, uh, we have to create plot for each of these. So let's uh, create the plot for north section that is the first column. Since we are plotting three, uh, three charts, let's do the subplot command. One comma, three comma one. So let's, to avoid confusion, you can just comment. So this is for the north. And then prop plot. Data. The first is for the north. Come on, distribution is normal. Plot is equal to PLT. Let's give the title PLT dot title normal curve plot. You can just type north. Similarly, I will just copy paste uh, and change these values so that. And this will be for south. Just change the head to south. And here also it will be for south. Similarly, we can do this for for central.
one thing you have to notice uh, is that um, so the number in the subplot will change so for the second one we will have to give 2 here and for the third one you have to give 3 rest everything is same so we have north south and the central now we can add the labels and the titles plt lot x label x label is uh, for the x axis we can it will be theoretical uh, quantiles or the set score and uh, for y label it is the ordered values or the observed or we can even write the Uh, payment time or whatever uh, data you have we can uh, label the head of that so here i have taken the payment time sample data so i am giving the payment time as the y label and uh, let's give plt.show let's see how this goes um I think you should have in the brackets let's run okay we got into some error no attribute to title should be small t yes now we have uh, the three plots but uh, if you look at the graphs these are very congested so let's uh, adjust the the uh, you know space plt dot subplot underscore adjust w space equal to zero point five So the issue was uh, uh, placing the you know you need to define this early so that's why it is so now we have the plots ready you can see here uh, three different plots uh, one for north one for south and one for central and you can see the north data points are in a linear um, fashion whereas um, the south and uh, uh, central are non-linear the central region is uh, skewed to the left and um, the the uh, south is skewed to the right so this is how this is how you can code the uh, code in python to get the uh, to check the uh, we are to visualize the uh, to check the data is normally distributed or not hope you're clear with this uh, um, tutorial if you like the video, please press the like button and share it with your friends. Thank you.